I'm Chef David Rose, and if you're watching this video, you're probably watching me to learn how to bake fish. Today we're gonna bake this lovely Omaha Steaks skin-on sockeye salmon. It's actually really easy to do. So let's get started. If you wanna take a deeper dive into the Omaha Steaks fish selection and explanations on seasoning, thawing, and marinating, be sure to check out our Seafood for Beginners Getting Started Guide. Salmon is only one of many examples of fish that bakes very well. You've also got halibut, bass, and grouper, which are also great for baking. Salmon is a great fish to bake because it's a tender, flaky, and fatty fish that really retains its moisture when baked correctly. Tools you're gonna need today include a baking sheet, parchment paper, a fish spatula, and a brush. While the salmon is on the counter, let it come up to room temperature for about 15 to 20 minutes. Then you take paper towel and dry off any excess moisture. From there, we're gonna rub it down with a little bit of olive oil and then season with salt, pepper, and Chinese five spice. While the salmon comes up to room temperature, let's make our simple and delicious chili orange glaze. In a medium saucepan, we add our sweet chili sauce, orange juice, sesame oil, soy sauce, and a small pinch of salt. We bring that to a boil, reduce to a simmer, and let it thicken until sauce-like consistency. About four to five minutes. First things first, what you're gonna do is place the parchment paper on a sheet pan and lay the salmon fillets skin side down. Then you wanna place it in the preheated 400 degree oven and bake undisturbed for 10 minutes. Once salmon starts to brown, you wanna brush the chili orange glaze on the fillets. You wanna place it back in the oven for another three minutes and brush with the glaze again. Return to the oven for another two to three minutes until nice, lacquered, flaky, opaque, and firm. You'll know it's done when all sides are golden brown, but still nice and moist on the inside at a perfect internal temperature of 145 degrees. This dish goes great with sauteed spinach and my Omaha Steaks quinoa fried rice recipe, which you can find on the blog. Now that you know how to bake seafood, you'll be hooked from here on out. Don't forget to check out the other videos in our Beginner's Guide to Seafood series, or hit up our blog for more recipes, tips, and tricks.